Hey everybody, welcome to day six of the Baseball Golden Goblet, a performance yesterday that, I mean, let's be real, must have put us in the running for gold. I'm not saying we won gold yesterday, but we gotta be at least in the running for gold. Today, we are playing as the Platypi at home. We're, we're just staying home every day. Versus Nemesis. Let me double check. Nemesis. Extreme power hitters. Oh, oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Platypi contact specialist. Let's send it. I mean, I feel like we had a, an unbelievably good hitting game. And the, the fielding game is just automatic. I love fielding in baseball. I, I, played, uh, I played softball for like, I don't know, close to 10 years growing up. I was a... Uh, let's call it what it is, okay? I was a great fielder and probably a below-average batter, but not a not necessarily an easy <laughs> an easy out. But uh, you know, I was probably like a. I mean, what, being a bad hitter in like middle school softball means that you still probably hit like 400, but very very few uh, extra base hits. Anyway, what was I saying? Oh, but fielding was like gold glove level by the, by those standards. I love fielding in baseball because it's just like, it's just an algorithm, you know? Now, I, I, I don't narrate the algorithm too much, but it's most of the time you're just fulfilling your role. It's a, it's a real bad situation here. I'm not going to be, I'm not going to mince words. You know, we, we really got to start shutting some batters down. Oh, that was an incredible pitch. All right. Now, three pitches, three outs. You got to love that. He loves a high pitch. He's not getting the high pitch. We're, we're going to keep this around his knees. And we got to get some good... We got to get up in the count a little bit. So that we can afford to bend them to our will. Now we can throw him some, like, disgustingly low curves. How about a slightly more ambitious curve oh baby our pitcher is pulling us out of a jam here all right same thing you got you gotta you gotta get in his head as long as you get the first you got nothing to worry about there you go all right got ourselves out of a little spice early but you love to see it the contact on kitty kaufman not my pitch i, I want to see what you got before we commit that that could have been a strike that was real close I gotta be honest. She's throwing. I think that was a. Oh, let's go. We're safe. That's just. That's just luck. You can't. You can't plan for that. Okay, we're definitely stealing. Send it. That on a slider, we're getting in there. I mean, they can't catch anyway. Apparently, so. Beefcake McStevens. It's a good pitch. It's not my pitch, but it's a good pitch for somebody else. That's a terrible pitch. It's close. It's close. It's actually not close at all. It's very low. Oh, you're be careful. You almost got sent. I love that. I think she's making it home. She's quick. She's quick. She's quick and nimble. Look at that. Okay, first run on the board. We're playing our game. That's a tough steal. I think I think we bet on the batter. Not my pitch. Not my pitch. We bet on the batter here. We should have swung at the first one and not swung at that one. I'll, I'll level with you. All right, Muffin Studwick. Look at this Ken Griffey batting stance. We know we're getting on base. You see someone with a high batting stance? In 1998, that was how you knew a Chad just stepped up to the plate. Okay, Willie Bacon. I don't know. We're about to find out, Willie. <laughs> Good pitch. Good pitch, but I want to see more out of you. Little, I, in my opinion, a little low. We'll have to agree to disagree on that one. Yo, but she's not very good at getting strikeouts. Well, <laughs> how, how is she at getting double plays? <laughs> okay, we're safe. We're safe. Oh, but Scooter, what's wrong, buddy? He's an RBI dud? Let's break that habit. Let's break that habit. I liked it immediately, but... I mean, that, that was a pitch we enjoyed. That wasn't. Shouldn't have swung at that one. Got in my own head. Okay, it's yips versus yips. Why would you swing at that? Like, it's just questions you ask yourself sometimes. That's all right. You know what? We got up 1-0. 
You can't be too upset about having the lead, I suppose. And we, we learned a little bit about the pitcher. We, we learned what, uh, what they got going. They got a lot of... They got some speed. They got some light breaks. And I have to admit, even though we're ahead, they got into my head a little bit. Not as much as, uh, as Ace is, though. Ace Von Aceson is just... I mean, he's, he's locked in. That's not a hit. That's a foul. We're still locked in. We're, we're pitching right to the corners. I mean, that's, that's an easy ground out. She, anytime you could do the double step into the throw, you got nothing to worry about. It's, it's, it's simple. Look at that. It's the exact same play. The second base woman is going to buy dinner for us after this because their, their stats are getting padded out of control. All right. Charlie Lopez, look at his photo. That's my guy. That's my guy. Charlie sends it. Oh, what did I tell you? Charlie hit me. And that really hurt. Charlie, he's, he's a middling stealer. Oh, I mean, if you're going to pitch that, I got to hit it. But that is painful. It is painful to just fly out to, to left field on that one, I'll admit. Okay. Ace... That's no good, Ace. But you know what? At least we got through you to get back to the top of the order. This is now our big money maker. I'm just going to be honest with you. I think we steal. I think we steal so we can start at the top of the order next time. I promise I'm not just doing this for the Mrs. Incredible view. We're stealing here. You throw a breaking ball, even though he's a little slow, he's in position. Okay, good stuff. Good stuff. It's good contact, but I think it's coming down. It's coming. That sucks. But you know what? It is what it is. We, we still got to the top of the order. So we're, we're gunning for a big inning next time. A little bit, you know, slower than last time, for sure. I, mean, I don't know why you would throw her something that is, like, hittable. You're so far up in the count. You might as well start working these corners, you know? <laughs> and you anticipated a two-strike slider? Well, why didn't you anticipate a strike uh, with a full count? We're already on three strikeouts. It's only the top of the third. Everything's going pretty well so far. <laughs> oh, you didn't see that one coming. Okay, that one you did see coming, and it makes perfect sense. It was not a good pitch. Fooled you. She's a tough out. We'll see about that. <laughs> Couldn't have been that tough. All right. Pit I like it. The pitcher's keeping the pitch count low. He's making the batter work for it. But we really, like, I think if we're going to have, like, a, a popped-off game like last time, that was bad. If we're going to have a popped-off game like last time, we really need to get inside of the pitcher's head. Let, let's not get too far ahead of ourselves. Like, we're not out of this inning yet. But it, but if we're going to have a, uh, if we're going to have the kind of performance we had last game, the time has definitely come for us to get inside of our pitcher's head. Man, you just... You're, you're a tough batter. You're not swinging at anything. How about that? And then, throwing you so much off speed. <laughs> and then, the rare two seam. Okay, you anticipated the two seam. We got a ball to work with, so we're playing head games. Nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that. So you might say, why not go to third? First, is, first base is what's called a force out. If the ball gets there before the runner gets there, they're, they're out. Third base, you got to actually touch the runner with the ball or the glove that holds the ball. So, uh, you know, it's a little bit less automatic, but that's, that's minutia. You, you need not concern yourself with the minutia. That's a good pitch, but I want to work her over a little. Beefcake waits for his hit. I mean, that's, again, make her get Tommy John surgery. That's just beautiful. I felt it. I felt it in my bones. I felt it in my bones. That's a solo shot. <laughs> oh, dab on him, King. Dab on him. Okay. Hera O. Wugliams. Now the pitcher. Testament to her resilience. Didn't affect her mojo at all. How about now? How about now? We got a, we got a speedster on first base. Ricky Henderson's on first base. Actually, they're very slow. 
It's an okay pitch, but it's not my pitch. Nope, Off speed, in and out, in and high? No. That's more my pitch. I felt that one going straight for the gap. All right. So we got, you know, first runners on first and second. No. Willie Bacon's up to bat. The pitcher is still unfazed. That's going to change. She's so slow. She's not making it. She's not making it. We got we to gotta stick with the bases loaded. It's a bases loaded situation. Now, I'll admit, Scooter, here's the thing. A better manager might swap in a better hitter. I want Ned Flanders here to have a chance to get over his yips. Not an encouraging start. I debate that one. I debate that one. Good eye. Come on, you're going to have to give me something worth hitting. I'll let you work that shoulder out. It's coming down. It came down. Let's go. We're, he's done it. And he kept the bases loaded, which is actually a bad thing. But look at the pitcher. The pitcher, she's starting to get a little rattled. Not my pitch. We're making her work for it. Her stam's getting roasted. We're going to make her throw herself out here. That's coming down. Oh, it's not coming down. You're not making it. You're not making it. Smart move. Smart move. Got a little greedy there. Tugboat Thomas. Beautiful. And I mean, you just go. Just go. Don't stop. That This is a huge inning. The pitcher is going to be destroyed. Our own pitcher steps up. And he ain't looking too bad. Contact. Contact above the halfway point, and he just got an RBI single. Does this seem familiar? I mean, I guess it's not an RBI single. Until he gets in there. God. What are you doing? But still. Not my pitch. Does this look familiar? They're, they're taking her out anyway. Oh, that might go. What a catch. Still, still. Going up six here. I'll take it, but we are about to have our last, uh, our last at bat. I love these low curves. You can, you can really punish them, but people, well, not people, the AI apparently. On 35 Ego, let's not draw too many conclusions, but the AI seems to hate swinging on, on low curves. Which is great, because you just put them into the strike zone. Oh, he even, he even second-guessed it. He's like, that's got to be low. Oh, and then he swung at the garbage one. Oh, <laughs> I mean, you got to, come on. You got to try to make some impressive plays here. I, I love a little low fastball, too. Make him work for it, you know? Great little double hop there. I don't throw high too much, I'll admit. I feel like a high curveball is very punishable. I don't know. I don't know much about the kinematics of batting. I always feel like a high pitch is, well, a pitch that's high but in the strike zone is easier to knock out. You know, absolutely wonderful hit right along the foul line. You're not going to second though. I, I encourage you to, if you think you got it, give it a try. If you think you got it, give it a try. And you are not fast enough to steal. And you know what? You're gonna get the third. I think. I think he's. Oh, he's gonna. He thought about trying. We got a laser beam from right field. All right, this is where we got to focus a little bit more. We're going we're gonna to work this batter. I got to admit, he's got a good eye. You anticipated that. You antis I've never thrown that pitch before, and yet you anticipated it. Here you go. Full count. You're number eight, so the pitcher's coming up next. They're going to hot swap you. I'd rather make life difficult by getting you out. How are we going to get you out? Change on the corner. Ooh, you son of a gun. The catcher didn't even know how to deal with it. Now we got to deal with the substituted batter. Oh, 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 no, no, no. I mean, just to be straight up with you, everything went fine on that last one. 
Except my catcher. My catcher kind of ruined it. I mean, the pitch was even in the strike zone. Good stuff. Okay. Huge strikeout. Oh, what a, what a style on him. Okay. This is our final at bat in all likelihood. We got a new pitcher, Binky Stevens. Not my pitch. Good sinker, but it's not my pitch. You're, you're really going for the intentional walk. Nope. Great stuff. We get on base. That's what we do. We get on base. Billy Bean Baseball. I think we take the steal here. That's a fastball. That's tough. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Too low. Way too low. Close. I didn't like it. I didn't like that one either, but it had to be done. Okay, hold it together. Where are we at here? Where are we at in the order? Fourth, and he's an RBI man. Too low. Too low. Trying to pick the corners came up short. Come on, come on. If that had just gotten free. If that had just gotten free. Willie Bacon, I'm relying on you, brother. Close. I, I wanted it, but it was a little out. Dude, you know what? I gotta, I gotta hand it to the pitcher. He got me hidden pitches that were strikes, but I didn't want to hit him. So we desperately need to uh, do a substitution. We're gonna put out our closer here. Walt Huckster. Let's look. Let's see how these look. Oh, that's pretty good. How about this? How does the changeup look? Oh my God, you're gonna, you're gonna get him biting on that in a big way. I'll admit, it's not the best closing pitcher we've ever seen. A 93-mile-an-hour fastball uh, ain't going to blow the doors off. You can do it. She's, she's fast. Oh, that's, that's tough. She's not that fast. She is, she is quicker than median, maybe. Steerike. Go for it. Go for it. Incredible. I gotta admit, I didn't see this coming. Take me take me to the cutoff, man. Oh, I know I know how to throw to the cutoff, man. I don't think we're, I don't think we're getting him out though. Yeah. A, a triple. 6-1. That hurts. That hurts. I'm not an infield positioning sort of guy. Um, and with no outs, we are gonna have to think about swapping out our closer with the reliever. My man's working on the blown save. So here's the thing. In baseball, you don't, you don't throw it a home on that one as much as you might think that that's ridiculous. You throw it a first. Now, baseball is not really played to get the highest run differential, so throwing a home might have been a sensible idea there, but what can I say? It's already programmed into my brain what I think I'm supposed to do. I got to be honest. After this at bat... Pretty tempted to yank this guy. Eh, maybe he can close it out. I mean, it's pretty low risk right now. They'd have to score four runs. He's got a long way to go. But he's his his stats are in the toilet. We're basically just we're hoping you like get out to fielding. All right, we gotta yank him. Honestly, Huckster, you should not be in the league anymore. You're, you're not you're not capable of pitching at this level. I'm sorry to say. Um, we're gonna we're gonna take you out and put in Remington Sharp instead. My man's throwing a, a 95 mile an hour fastball as a reliever. I mean that's the kind of thing it's gonna give you nightmares. Then we throw you a little one of these. Oh, it started in the strike zone. You got a little greedy. You feel intense? What about this one? Starts in the strike zone and comes out. All right, they they want to work it. They want to work it. They want you want to work it. Take a take a fastball outside. All right, all right. We're gonna break you. We're gonna break you. If you're gonna steal, we're gonna break you. The speed is so low. I'm so tempted to give a walk here. Come on. Easy money. All right, we took it. 
we took it down. It was 6-2. Um, does hurt a little bit. Gave up some stuff in that last inning, but you, you live with it. You live with it, right? A pretty okay performance for now. Thanks for watching. Hope you've enjoyed it. If you watched all 20 minutes and 9 seconds, I'm going to assume that you did enjoy it. If you did, click the like button. It's the single best way to help a content creator whose content you enjoyed sends a message to YouTube. Hey, show this content to more people is good. So again, if you enjoyed the episode, please do click the like button. Apart from that, thanks for watching. Check out Dan and Mouse Perspectives, goldengoblet.net for scores and results. And I'll see you next time. See ya!